There's nothing for you here. Yes, I'd heard things were rough there, too. Luck only comes to those who help themselves. I've heard that before. The same day in, day out. What the fuck do you want? Power, shards, and an easy life. How about you? <laughs> Already got them. They're overrated. I really don't like small talk. So tell me what you want or leave me the fuck alone. Who the fuck are you? You really want to know who I am? You really want to know? Tough shit. I was hoping at least one person in the fort knows what's going on. Are you that person? Maybe. Listen, I meet a dickhead a day who tries lines on me. So unless you've got some real business, or unless my brother the Duke sent you, take the talk to someone else. Sure. Okay. I've heard about what you've been doing here. You've blown into Tavar and stirred things up. Most newcomers start at the bottom and take years to crawl up. You're making enemies here. You know that? Some people are getting upset by your successes. Yeah. Yet here you are, already getting people to trust you. Question is, are you going to stay and help build things here in the fort? Or blow out of here as quickly as you blew in? If you want me to stay, you have to give me a reason to stay. You've got a whole lot of mouth, haven't you? We're going on a little trip, you and me. Then, we'll find out who you really are. When do we go? This is the way you prove to me you're ready to stay. And that it's worth the Duke keeping you on. This is the time to prove it. Okay? I have news from Ignodon. The clerics are planning a big offensive against the Alps. So? What does that have to do with me? We're gonna finish my business, and until then, I don't care what the clerics are doing. Yeah, good job. So the Duke is your brother. Is he your own relation here? William's my cousin, but it takes more than blood to make you a relation. William works for the Duke. He gets things done his way, I get things done my way. I'm ready to go. Okay, I'll see you outside, in front of the city. So, friend, as you can see, that area over there is infested by large, ugly creatures with a taste for human flesh. What you have to do now is simple. Go there and kill them. Think you can handle that? Yeah, I can handle that. Okay, so stop talking about it and make it happen.
Did I pass your test? That's a start. Come and see me when you've recovered. Maybe Tavar does have a use for you. We'll soon find out. And here you are, back again. Ready to go? I'm ready. What is it about? I'll show you when we're there. We? Is this just the two of us? Does that scare you? Are you scared of a challenge? Come on, we'll take care of this alone. Come on, let's get this job done! There he is, El Colisado, the terror of our runners. We've sent several teams to find him and kill him. And obviously, they lost. Yeah, most of our guys just run from it. Piss ants. What makes him so dangerous isn't just his strength, it's how clever he is when fighting. So be careful, and give him everything you've got. You want to go down there now? Yeah, you and me. We go down there together, we fight together, we stick together. <laughs> Let's see if you've got the legs.
So, that creature's down to me, is it? Oh, fuck. I suppose I'll have to deal with this one. So, that creature's down to me, is it? So, that creature's down to me, is it? So, that creature's down to me, is it? El Colisado. That thing was killing our runners. Why couldn't they take care of it? You sound like William. Runners might be expendable, but we can't make a profit without them. Fucking William. If it's not shards lying on the sand, he can't understand the true worth of it. Why didn't we bring more men? We didn't need them. That thing could have killed both of us. But it didn't. So, here we are. Is killing creatures all we're going to do? There are more challenges out there. We'll find them. We make a good team. You are talking about profit here, right? Because challenge and profit is all I'm looking for. But, okay. If you find me a good enough challenge, something to really shake shit up, I'll think about it. How about taking the fight to the Albal Exeters and Zaycor? Would that be a big enough challenge? Fight the leader of the Albs? Well, that certainly is a challenge. It's also suicide without a plan. But if you come to me with a plan, sure, why not? Fuck it, let's destroy the Alps, just the two of us. The Adjudicator Ulbricht is planning a huge offensive against the Alps in Ignodon. Good. Then the clerics and the Alps can take care of each other. It's the clerics' damn fault we have the Alps in the first place. Ulbricht needs a field commander. I think you should take that command. Me? Why would I help the clerics clear up their problems? And with Ignadon gone, where do the Albs go next? Idan. They hate the Berserkers. Do you really believe in all this shit? Causes don't get you anywhere. Why should I fight for them? Albs want all the Elix, be it in Ignadon, Idan, or Tavar. They will come here. And you think fighting a battle in Ignodon for the clerics will help? And what difference am I supposed to make? You captured the fort, didn't you? And you want a new challenge. Destroying the Alps converter in Ignodon. Now that's a challenge. And this cleric is so desperate he'll ask an outlaw to lead his men? Yeah, he must be desperate. <laughs> well, if it's desperate times... That's what I do best. I'm in. You're sure? I took the fort. I planned it. I led it. What have I done since? So sure. Whatever. Let's go and fuck up some albs. Better than wasting away here. Good. Then I found the commander they need. They know my history. They know I can lead. I'm ready to deal with any troll shit they think about me. A chem-dealing outlaw who kills clerics and doesn't believe in Kalan? You think they can deal with that? Then... I'm in. As long as you join me in this. I'll leave for the Hort and talk to this Ulbricht. You better not be troll-shitting me about this, and you better be ready to fight. 
Yeah, good job.